Oh, that's right. I almost forgot about this. It was all a dream. Ow! Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, Project's dream. Yeah, that has a random that's chance new. of happening. Whoa. <laughs> Look at them peepers. Ah, my eye. <laughs> oh, ah, yeah. my other eye. And secret jiggy. It's not necessarily secret. It's like, hey, pound here, dumbass. That's a oh. real eye opener. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Anywho, we're gonna we're going off to the second hub of the area. Yep. Or third just hub, as I guess. Soon as we opened the door. Actually, the third hub. That's what I just said. I, uh, caught oh, I thought you said the second hub. We're gonna start seeing the architecture of this mountain get all screwy. Welcome to the next hub area. Ooh. All grunty all the time. <laughs> we're at the final boss already. Welcome to the grunty variety hour. <laughs> <laughs> Grunty all day, every day. So this, ca so I mean, I will say I like this idea. I'll, I will say I do like this idea a bit more than Banjo Tooie and this whole massive world. It, uh, this is all taking place in one castle. It's just massive. It's just it, they're basically taking the the exact same uh, gimmick from Mario sixty four and pretty much bringing it up to its ult ultimate its proper conclusion. I gotta say that is one of my favorite parts about. Ooh. Hey, keep your feet out. You can't use us until you've spoken to Bottles. Those boots are yeah. farting at us. Yes, they are. What were you saying there, Icky? And on the other side, oh, we uh, just Ricky. give it a second. Oh, give oh us here goes Silly. Tips. My battle sister's favorite, favorite sport is broomstick racing. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, that actually sounds great. I forgot what I was doing for the shaky one. She just gets all wiggly and scared. <laughs> or act like you're choking on something when you save the wiggly yeah. bits. You wouldn't believe if I did this party trick is boy. Well, yeah, I think that's a little try hard, but okay. We're then. just gonna. This game, go. it slays me. Anyways, uh, what I was trying to say before, I. With the castle. When thing. I'm nice and slim once more, burgers, fries, and chips galore! <laughs> You'll just lose it again. Anyways, Bubble Gloop Swamp. I was trying to say before. God damn it, bottles! I was trying to. Uh, just, just talk over me at this point, dude. I'll sacrifice okay, voice uh, to get your thought. Oh, flip it. Oh yeah. By the way, that that one new one new um ability he wants to give you, right here. Just right here. Anyways, um, I love the standard mooks and Grunty's uh, caves. You know, the little uh, guys. I thought they were like monkeys or something, but no, they're goblins and cheats. Um, I just love how Voiced apathetic by, uh, they uh, come off to be. And uh, yes, almost uh, and yes, those guys are also voiced by Grant Kirkle. Grant, like, they, this game was interesting. And a lot of Rare's uh, games are interesting in that a lot of them they didn't really get full-on voice <clears throat> actors. They just had staff members. Yeah, fun. yeah. And for the most part, it worked out. Oh yeah, I, I should have said this earlier, but by this point in time, every level only, every other level you'll go through this game only has one bottle's ability okay. for you. It's Gator Golf. Mm -hmm. <gasps> yeah! yeah! Yummy! Crackers <laughs> like that. <laughs> No, shut up, I'm doing gator golf. <laughs> <laughs> Me, what? You want to be too? Ah, <laughs> Let the gator golf fan have his time. Anyways, what are these? Reeds or matchsticks? Banjo? <laughs> you saw that, right? They're reeds. Also, I'll say I saw it. They, I, I will say, Bone Blue Swamp is probably my favorite level. The music's cool. I like the theme and like all the giant like architecture around this place. It's one of my it's one of my favorite levels in the game. I would not really say it's my full on favorite, but it's definitely one of the more tight tightly um, created levels in the game. My yeah. only real problem with it is that two of the j two of the jiggies in particular are they're really not my, one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, one of them sucks, but I will say so I'll say I like the I like the level layout of this one the best, but my favorite music is Freeze Easy Peaks. Ow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we'll be going to Freeze Easy Peaks soon enough. That song is my jam. Anyway, back, sorry, back to you. Anyways, one important factor about Global Gloop Swamp that you want to take note of, don't fall into the actual swamp. You will get e uh, eaten by piranhas. Mm-hmm. And, because it's there to, it's there to, oh, ah! okay. This is piranha water. Keep your smelly feet out. Which I like, which I like that they don't outright villainize them. They're just like, hey, get out. Get yeah. out of my swamp. Yeah, yeah they're just yeah, some little yeah. fuckers until you mess with their swamp. Yeah, you have a time limit for this jiggy, and it's fairly easy to fall off this uh, part of the. Uh... Oh jeez! Oh. <laughs> for a second, I thought you were about to fall, and I was going to be you like, so "Oh, wish you were in Banjo Tooie now." Was... Yeah, I was like, "You're yeah." Was a bit of a risky gamble. 
Yeah, because uh, one interesting part about Banjo's moveset, or lack thereof, um, he can't grip onto edges. At least he can't yet. the sequel. Yep. Hey, Which is cool. weird. Why did they save that for the sequel? Yeah, they probably just didn't think about it at the time. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was just well, easier to obviously account Obviously he for can't account. grab ledges, because look at those hands, they're practically double damn mittens. Yeah, they they're are. Paws. <laughs> well, then again, they're be that's better than Mario's hands being chicken nuggets. <laughs> what? They look like little chicken nuggets. They're like the, the, the big fists. The big, the big nuggets. I, I, okay, like maybe nuggets is the best. No, they're more like they're more like white potatoes. That's a That's giant right. crocodile. What's up, yes, Siri? it is. What? You thought you had like a big little chuckle there. The chocodile. Nuggets. <laughs> nuggets. <laughs> nuggets. Oh, oh boy. Oh jeez, I'm gonna take Silly out to this These frogs are jerks. Place. <laughs> yes, but they're our jerks. Well, we, like they give us free honeycombs. Have you mm -hmm. ever had Have you ever had Korean style fried chicken? I don't think mm. so. Once I have. It's actually super good. There's this place. There's this place by my house called Bonchon. That or Chon. It's it's one. It's one. It's one of them orderings of the syllables. But uh, one of those orders of syllables. Um, and they they serve it. It's like they, it's a little bit crispier than normal. But they also have this super good like seasoning Ooh. packet to it. Oh, we have to, we have to hit that. Okay, we now more. we now return to Banjo commits. Uh, what's it called? We uh, destroy the egg. egg. No, more. not egg aside. Um, Don't worry, it was just the nice meaty yolk of a jiggy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no, it's a baby jiggy. Oh, uh, remember the freaking dark ending that had? What? Oh uh, yeah, that was something else. You know, I really should catch up more with that show. Like, I watched the first handful of episodes when it's on Netflix. I want to say it still is. But I really should watch more of it. Like, I remember when I was younger, I used to have a VHS that had two episodes of it. One of it involved the baby, and it had this horn that grew on its head, and everyone acted like he was some kind of, like, messiah because of it. And the epi other episode where the grandma pre uh -oh. had a near-death experience. We just stepped into, un we just stepped into enemy territory. Oh, no! The dogs! Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> Run! Get I'm sorry. Are these yeah. dogs or frogs? I don't know. They're not. They're they're, they're jumping they're frogs, out of logs. Like dogs. That jump they out take of logs. not one but two hits to defeat. Oh, yeah. the log. Anyways, what show were you talking about with a kid in a hole's head? The dinosaur puppets. Dinosaur puppets? The Muppet. The freaking Jim Henson like. Wait, dinosaurs. Sponsored. The dinosaur. Yeah, we're, that's what we were talking about with the baby and the dinosaurs. Wait, that's on Netflix. Uh, 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 Hype seems to think so. Well, we'll, 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 we'll have to wait until after the dog correspondent to him to get tell us. Of forest limits, take our gold, jerk. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You stupid bear. Yeah, real cool of you to kill us. No, so anyway, what was I saying? So, um... Yeah, no, no, that show had a really dark ending to it, because, uh... Oh, yeah. Biz, 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 business did. corporations basically pollute the world to the point of an ice age happening, and, uh, as you all know, uh, realist, re real, real history, the dinosaurs didn't really get out of that too well. I mean, is it any different from the ending of Clone High, when you think about it? No, except Clone High at least led itself to possibly having a sequel. <laughs> I, well, there you go! I liked Clone High, though. I do, too. I mean... Actually, now that when you stop and think about it, I know this is kind of reaching, but technically dinosaurs do still oh. exist in our society. They're the other white meat. <laughs> hey oh. <laughs> and on that note, that should be the last time we get to hear the dogs this session. Okay. Hooray! Uh, hype. Hype. You, finally put, you finally put Big Necka down. And here, hype. And here, hype was a uh, hype. James was curious. Dinosaurs is on Netflix. Um, it was last time I checked. Huh. I'll have to look into that later. So why are these? Alligators made of solid gold. Because they are. There's really no. There's really no rhyme or reason to it. They just are. And I guess as a way, to, as just to show that they're not exactly your enemies. Hmm. That they do stick out compared to the rest of this uh, na nature-ridden swamp. <laughs> so yeah, all that's well. All that's well said and done. Um, I'm trying to remember what I do after this. Um, uh, we go to the turtle. I want to see. We, oh, god damn it! Look at all the shiny things that I can't get because I'm yeah. barefoot. Piranhas hates the bears. Uh -huh. Get it, barefoot? Uh, don't make me slap your head off. Hey, banjo! I hear beer makes you stupid. <laughs> no one doesn't. Ooh, my feet are so numb and cold. 
old. Then bring them back into your shell, you Hey, I know, the perfect remedy. Oh! <laughs> but, but honestly, okay, I know it's relaxing, but everyone shush. Every, listen to this. This is not relaxing. Listen to what happens to the poor guy. This hurts! <laughs> I love that sound effect. I'm surprised he even feels that, considering what? he just said they were cold and numb. He can't feel Here we go shit. again. Three, two... <laughs> oh, my poor friend! Thank foot. you so much! Really appreciate it! And for our efforts, he opens up a jiggy. Mm, tank tops warm at last. Perhaps you like this. Oh, and, and if you tank haven't, or, and if and if you haven't already gotten, and if you haven't already gotten enough fun out of freaking punishing and torturing the guy, now we're about to choke him to death. In a manner of speaking, yes. Sort of. Well, first let's grab it. Let's grab his. Let's grab his little gift to us. And I forget what I'm doing with the. Oh, You're then I just realized I'm, I'm, I'm too tall. So, Join us um, next time on the Gui Channel. Here we go. This everybody. is just oh! fucking weird. This part coming up. Let us make a journey to the center of this turtle. <laughs> a journey to the center of tank top. I knew oh. it. My biology teacher didn't know Jack. There's a fucking turtle course in here. Actually, would these happen to be his vocal cords? Maybe. <laughs> and it's also and. As Icky will like, it's also being led by another Diddy Kong Racing person. Hey! Quiet, please. The famous Tip Top Squire will now perform my latest work. This Ahem. is the Icky Hour of this game, James. Sorry. No, I know, I'm just joking, but yeah, there's a lot. I'm having okay, fun. It's... That's I... fair. It's short, isn't it, child boy? Well, oh, see, copy what you just heard for lesson one. Well, how are we gonna copy their moves? Same thing we did with the big turtle. That's fucking oh, morbid, guys. though. No, no. Huh? They're all right. Ish. Mm, not too bad. Try lesson two. And the turtle's like, please, no more lessons. <laughs> they even sound like singing. It sounds like they're trying to cough up something. No, they just sound like higher pitched versions of the um. Uh... No, they just sound like higher pitched versions of the uh, Kremlings from uh, Donkey Kong Country. I. I we check that Kong actually? Ow! Uh oh. No, that's Oops. not right. Try I again. Or ask me to repeat the lesson. Ow. <laughs> now, the so why do we that... get hurt? Well, I like, think it's the fact that you technically aren't, don't have to repeat the pattern if you, for, if you uh, make, make the wrong choice. <laughs> and yeah. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm not making padding out this video any longer than it needs to be. Yeah, this part takes a while. Yes. Ah, splendid. You just need one more lesson. All right. Really? Little, little, little. <laughs> At this point, you should have just replaced the turtle sounds with like random sound effects. <laughs> I could have, but I, hey, I figured what we have here is enough. You could do Siri. it in post. Imagine, like, you, re you, rep can, you replace like, one of these turtles. Oh, the Tom yell. One turtle can be the J. Jonah Jameson laugh. Prepare to fast say, forward. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, Sealy, one of replace one of these things with the. Oh! <laughs> oh God! Someone, <gasps> someone, please do that. <laughs> it's the. It's, uh... it's, 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 if I'll G okay, James, you're going to die. Stop it. Stop <laughs> James? it, James. Okay. Oh, he did it. Magnificent. A true masterpiece. Here, take this trinket I found earlier. Look at how disappointed Banjo and Kazooie look with your performance Yay. up there. What were we referencing, Logan? The, it's the cringe. Warface scream from Full Metal Jacket. <laughs> oh, so that's where that's from. Uh, <laughs> That's, That's a war face. face. I love to say you war face. <laughs> admittedly, with that, admittedly, with that one, um, admittedly with this one mini game, I was almost tempted during like that fast forward, like the very last turtle, like they, they were all like sped up. And, <laughs> I, for some reason, I thought it was would have been a fun idea. Like, Guys, the last one would go. Yes. She's a wolf in mouse clothing. Ah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> what were you saying, James? James? Yeah, what were you gonna do there, James? During the whole. I was thinking at first, like doing like when I was fast forwarding the whole sequence, like I make them all sped up, and then at the very last one, it had the most deepest, loudest. Oh, <laughs> that would not. Or you could have just put an oh banana. But then oh, again, banana. 
admittedly, that does sound kind of funny. That does sound funnier. So I don't know. Just I'll do it in both. Just, just do something in both. Surprise the viewers. But no, Surprise I us. Just imagine, but now he's imagine. Ah, that's your war face. Let me see your war face. For like various ah. cartoon scream sound effects. No, not even that. It came saying, "Let me see your war face," and the guy just responds with, "Ah." <laughs> <laughs> the inverse <laughs> situation. Oh shit! You didn't convince you know, me. Are you I have, like, an idea of that, the whole, show me your war face! Uh, like, instead, like, when it comes to the guy, instead of the guy, it cuts to... There's this one song from the Donkey Kong cartoon where it's, like, Funky and Diddy are trying to convince DK to go on a treasure hunt with him, but he, but DK's not because he has a date with Candy. And there's one point in the song when they're singing to him, <laughs> Diddy sings, like, don't you want riches galore? And it shows just, like, this close-up of DK, and he just goes, no. <laughs> have that be like, show me your face. Let oh, no. <laughs> well, I me mean, at, well, I mean, at that point, you may as well just have. Well, I mean, at that point, you may as well just have. You may just well swap the editing around, so you just have Mario from Hotel Mario talking to Donkey Kong. Go so back. The both of us going. No. 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 <laughs> no. Uh. More original. Can I just say I find it funny whenever I try, whenever I fast forward the footage, whenever and using the talent try. It's just I don't know why that's so it's funny fun. to me. <laughs> So what's yeah, that over there? It's a red flippin' you dummy. No, on the on the other way. That's a ginger. Oh, 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 no, be... on the other side of the flippin'. <laughs> That's just a. It's your war face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. No, a no. tailed frog. <laughs> Very unique. What my you? frog, my frog is the right one. <laughs> Fuck this! I'll just use invincibility. Get it over with. Oh jeez. But James, man, they're valuable. I don't need them. I don't need, <sighs> need them all the time. I'll you could sell the remainder for shekels. No for shekel. Who? Also, also, actually, I'm curious. So I know that talking to Brent Tilde fills up your health. Is there any way to quickly refill any items you have? Mm, um, no. Not, not that I, as far as I can remember. No. Maybe talk, maybe you got to talk to bottles. You got to manually replenish them by collecting them. Yeah, that's that's true. Mm. It's not like it's not like Donkey Kong 64 where I think, or no, no, not even. Well, I know Donkey Kong 64 had just certain times where where you just. It's not even like a consumable. It's just like you approach the um, icon general and just completely replenishes your musical energy. No, really? Oh yeah, oh that's right, the, the headphones. Yeah, the headphones. And then, well, then uh, in other cases, you talk to uh, Funky and he'll give you all your ammo back. By the way, James will be yeah. right now because I'm not touching that again. <laughs> yeah. That's all I'm just waiting, for, hoping for, is that if there's if there is an N64 classic and they put that on there, <clears> just to save me some time and frustration of emulating it. Oh crap, that's right. And if you can't, then I'm the one who can do it because I own a Wii U. Yep. <laughs> well, then again, you could also subject hype to the torture. I could. Oh, what game is this again? Donkey Kong 64. I don't own it. But do you it's have on the Wii U console? Yeah, it's on the Wii U yes. Virtual Console, and I highly recommend you rather play the original as opposed to. The uh, the uh, Wii U version. Like so. Trust me, the Wii U version really fucking sucks. I don't it's, think it sucks. Honestly, it's, like, not, it's not the worst thing in the world. It just it does overclock a few things. Well, in, in particular, the only thing that I saw that was a problem was the uh, mini game where you have oh, to shoot the where you have to shoot the fairies in the mini game because of something to do with like the timer and processing speed you literally do not have enough time to shoot them unless you use I would the pause exploit I would say the wor I would say one worse than that is when you have to um, shoot all the golden bananas and avoid the Kongs oh yeah there's that one too that, yeah that to one can get especially annoying well, not, to well, not to mention then there's freaking getting all the call oh, I hate I hate getting these notes because those little pillars like the, the camera angle can trick you yeah yeah and we made it Yay, and look, Mumbo's hut is back! Also, yeah, it's an enemy from the you beginning. The Fuck you! <laughs> you wanna know the best part about these galoshes, Kazooie? They're banana flavored! What? <laughs> it's a reference to 900 Frights. Like, when you get the galoshes power up, Professor Graham actually says that. Oh, okay. What? <laughs> Interesting. Did, did I'm sorry, I blanked out there for did, a did, second. Did we, did, we mention that, did we mention that Professor Graham is also criminally insane? Oh, yes. There's a thing behind him. Yeah, there we go. How do you <laughs> he stole his dad. Really? Ooh, oh, I there's saw another that. thingy. You've been holding out on me, Mumbo. Right. Well, yeah, no. Well, okay, Aw, we're a tiny little alligator. 
Gator. Oh, Wait, no. Mumbo need new boots. Oh, no. no. Kidding. Now I am become Gator Gold. Okay, and then Wait, what, what I was trying to do was about to bite his, bite his feet, but I actually really forgot hit that the same the button path. retransforms me. Oops. Oops. Well, this is awkward. Wait, does that oh, usually it's... happen? Yeah, no, 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 no. Okay, so Icky, whenever you stand on that platform and you hit B, that activates the transforming back manually. That's oh, right. I thought as if you just press the button, you start it instantaneously. No, 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 just on the skull pad. Oh. I was trying. I was trying to do a gag, and it sort of fall, fell on its face because I forgot it. it also, that's also the same button you use to retransform yourself. I'll be right back. Mm. But yes. Okay. 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 Whoa. An alligator I found in the sewers. I named him. Alligator. See you later, alligator. Ugh. And now we come to one of my least favorite mini games in the entire game. This one can be tricky, especially on the second oh, time. There you go. Mm-hmm. And this is something you actually have to do like three times in a row. So meet Mr. Vile. Gator combat. Uh -huh, hey, hey, I'm Mr. Vile. Give me this crack of all. <laughs> <laughs> Press A to accept or read it. Okay, it's, it's an eating game. Eat more red yumblies! Yeah. Press X to eat yumblies. Three, two... It's simple at first. Yeah, you're just eating red yumblies. Though the problem here is that Mr. Vile is a very competent player. In fact, if you don't get a head start, he's he's pretty much gonna out... He's pretty much gonna overwhelm you. The best way... The best way to beat him is... Because this AI is pretty much working the exact same way. You need to have the best kind of tracking as him, which is any any second that you spend not heading directly as a b okay, any second that you spend not making a beeline for the nearest Yumbly is a second wasted. Yeah, and by the way, those shoes there aren't just for show. The crocodile transformation can use them later, but I will admit I didn't think, I didn't have the hindsight to do that until late game, oh which is fine. It is possible to do it without it, but as you can see. Vile can get, make this a really close game. Yes, yes yeah. he can. He's a ra yeah, he's a vile player. Just don't lose it. Oh, I, I guess Ooh, that I, I was gonna say real quick. Looking at how the game is designed, I found it interesting that before the timer ran out, the game already decided, yeah, you're going to win this, and gave you the achievement like it knew ahead of time. Either that, either that, or either that, or it just it, it just gave me that for how many I was able to eat. Okay. So, so yeah, now we gotta keep. Now we have another stipulation. We have to do the entire game again. Only this time, now we have to ignore yep, the yellow yellows, yellows. which Catch are even. clearly not snakes. Oh, yeah, right there. Catch even one of them little boogers. You know, poison the darn catch. Yeah, pretty much. Basically, if you eat a yellow yumbly, not only does that not count, it also stuns you for a little bit. Doesn't it also... Doesn't oh, the, it would have been wait. nice if he could eat the old ones, too, and get stunned as well. Man, doesn't it all... That'd be funny. Doesn't it also... Oh, that is cool, though. Is you can actually steal the Yumbly out of his mouth, even if he's in the animation sometimes. Also, if you want also if you want a consistent speed boost, keep pressing the B button. Ah. What, what bumped into you there? I ac I think I accidentally ate a yellow Yumbly. It must have been, like... It, mu he mu it must have happened, like, literally the frame as he was going over it. Yeah. Oh jeez, oh jeez. And the sad part is, this is an e this is only the second of three games. There's a trick here. Oh, yeah, Whoop. we have one more round. Ah, uh, just by a thread. My lucky greeny wins. Must play last game. Only eat what is shown. At Basically now, who cares about eating unripe food that's bad for you? Now you can, Simon says, eat whatever color is up there. Mm -hmm. And if you accidentally eat the opposite, same rules apply. You get, you get stunned. Now, fortunately, they aren't mean about it. They will, um... If you're in the middle of eating something and it changes, it'll still be fine. Yes. They were that They were that smart about it. Like, right there, I did... Okay, I, I think like I ate a... Uh, yeah, so far, so good. This is that, yeah. again, you do have to be careful of, uh, Vile when he, when he actually gets to a pile of these things. So, James, what hap explain to them what happens if you lose one of these. If you lose, well, Mr. Vile gets gets his gets um gets the first hand privileges okay. to get a bite out of your bite of your ass, and then you have to restart the restart the mini game. But thankfully, you only have to restart from the from the phase you were on at the time. Oh shoot! Also, uh, nuts, also nuts! Come on, fuck! Oh. Ah. 
run. Mother, Mr. Vile wins! Now Rainy gets cheered. Alright, I guess I'll accept my fate. Take your lumps! Whoop! Thankfully only does that once. So, uh, what was I gonna say? I uh, can't fight him back. I know. Also, something that uh, James was using there in that last in that last round, which is actually pretty useful, is you can uh, kind of a thank you. Is you yeah. can uh, is that you can abuse Mr. Vile's top speed to basically ride along him as he'll carry you to the goals quicker. Yeah. Now, and that's back. pretty much by the back. No, unfortunately, you can't. can't. Let's nah. get going. I mean, it would be nice, but unfortunately, you unfortunately he's just that his leather is just that much tougher than yours. Now that I think about it, I wouldn't mind making a, n a nice pair of boots with that fucker. <laughs> dude, it's a nice red, dude, red leather would look so cool. Any oh, 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 oh. And it's here where I realize I can actually use the small alligator form to my advantage. You can cut. Oh, that's right, because he's immune to the toxic ooze. No, yep. piranha. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, piranha infested waters, so. My bad. Fair enough. In any case, in any case apparently piranhas ha have it fine with um, alligators, so. Or crocodiles. I think they're, it's they're a They're fine. They're golf buddies. Yep, they're golf buddies. <laughs> they gate of golf buddies. We did it. And Nicky's not here to see him, so he had to walk the dog, so. It, well, odds are he probably won't get. Nice. Odds are he probably won't get here by the time we're done with this, but, um... Oh, well. I mean, have, we're pretty much done anyway. Have you ever gamed over? Game over. Um... Over. Honestly, it's been a while since I uh, game, o game over legitimately. Like, I, rem I think maybe back when I was, like, back in my early childhood when I started playing this game, but otherwise, it's really hard to... Honestly, if you know what you're doing, it's actually pretty hard to lose a life in this game. Oh yeah, and James is also, if he goes down that path to the back, he's going to learn the hard way of how much of a pain it is to get this particular, uh, thing. Yeah, this is probably one of the more obnoxious bits of backtracking you'll encounter in the game. Out well, of, like, three or three or four of them. One of them is. So, you need to, um, over here is our next puzzle piece, but there's also another area that's to the left oh boy. that you need... Oh wait, no. Oh wait, you can't get it actually. Oh, okay. I'm not... Oh wait, no, no. But you need to come here first as banjo because we normally to break it. Yep. Unfortunately, your jaws just aren't powerful enough to break this ice. Will Will you be showing off what's back there? I think I do. Yeah, but not till later. Okay, that's a that's a new character but that yeah. we'll see later. You're a cold-blooded animal in the winter area. You should be dead. But we get to unlock one of my favorite music-themed areas. Rizzi Peak. Otherwise known as Christmas Christmas every year. Yay! Every, no, no, Christmas every, every day. No honestly, the, no, honestly, the music in that place is so jolly and it's so fun. Yeah, I it's have returned. Christmas, it's, welcome, back. It's, welcome back. Oh, hey, oh I'm you, sorry you, you for just, that. You missed, out on, you missed out on my epic beatdown against Mr. Vile. Oh, huh, yeah. man. I'll catch it in the playback. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> But other than that, we've uh, finished it, and now we're gonna head upwards to try and uh, get to, because James is gonna be weird and do Freeze Easy Peak before Gobi's Valley. Ooh. To be fair, I think they expect you to do Freeze Easy Peak before Gobi Valley. I always got that feeling as well. Well, see, there's this odd thing that you're gonna see, is that Freeze Easy Peak, the, isn't it Freeze Easy Peak that teaches you the Buzz Bomb or whatever? Uh, yeah, it is. Yeah. Ooh. Like, there's but, one, there's at least one Jiggy that you can't get in Bubble Goop Swamp without oh. going to Gobi's Valley. And to get the boot, to get the shoes. Wait, yeah. wait you're, no, you're talking about Freeze Easy Peak. No, no, yeah, no, you need to go Freeze Easy Peak to learn the Buzz Bomb in order to go get to a Gobi's Jiggy Val in Gobi's Valley. So and then Gobi's but, Valley, but Gobi's you get Valley, the Speed the shoes, shoes that let you complete the uh, second race second in Freeze race. Easy so, Peak. Either, so what we're saying here is no matter what, you're going to have to do some backtracking, and this is the only time you ever have to do that. Correct. Which makes it very, uh, for lack of a better word, it's jarring. It's, it's just a little annoying, because like, cause if you don't know ahead of time, the game has not led you to believe you need to do this anywhere else, so I, I bet there are some people who tried so hard on that second race multiple times and just couldn't do it. Yeah. Also, nice nice pair of boots there. Not, not like I need them right now. And let's see where this leads to. Oh, did you look at that? Ow! We, we the belly of the beast. And that was the, sh that was the shortest journey to the center oh, of Grunty I've ever uh. seen. Many tricks are up my sleeve. To save yourself, you'd better leave. But then there's no game. Then I win. I just now get this really funny image of like, 
What if, what if without even have to, having to fight Grunty, just one of these rhymes ends up hitting too close to home, and Grunty's like, Why well, yeah, I just think you're fat? What do you think about that? And Banjo's like, Oh man, he just leaves, and he just gives up because his feelings were hurt. Aww. Well, I didn't expect that to actually work. And there I was thinking I was just a huge jerk. I was thinking the exact same thing, too. Hey. Rhyming's fun. Also, eggs can break webs, as James will learn eventually. Which took me the longest time to learn. Yeah, the game doesn't ever tell you that that, oh. that it can happen, but uh-oh. It's a beehive with bees! And the bees are mad. <laughs> the bees are angry. So, yeah, when you break it, you, you have to run away a bit before you can even get to the health. It's very interesting. Or you could just grab the health and grab the health at your at your own discretion. Cheese it. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and, and cheese it. So yeah, um, next time, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go off to Christmas land. Oh jeez. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. See you next time. Bye. See you guys. Bye. Oh, oh, oh.